local news tonight at 5.30, a portable basketball hoop for kids on one local street was taken away, leaving a mother frustrated and angry. 7 Action News reporter Dave Llewellyn has her story from Highland Park. Highland Park police responding to a neighbor's complaint of a basketball hoop in the street. It was right here. Right here in front of this sign. But very quickly, that hoop was taken away by a local towing company. When I come home that afternoon, the rim was gone. The police took it without warning, without a citation or anything. Police tell Action News a city ordinance prohibits leaving hoops in the street. Miranda Kreider says it had only been there one night, used only one time by her two boys and their friends. Children don't have nowhere to play yeah. nowadays, and I'd rather for them to play at home where they're safe. The original bill was $245. Miranda complained about the price. Police got the tow company to lower it to $75, but it would take another $75 to get it brought back here. That's another 75 that Miranda, a single mom of three, didn't have. You think it was harsh? Yes, I do. I think it was very harsh. Kids, like I say, they don't have anything to do. The hoop was taken to Troy's Towing in Detroit, the company that has a contract with the city of Highland Park. After paying the reduced fee today and to save the other 75 bucks, the hoop was loaded into the bed of a friend's pickup truck but no way it would be safe to travel like that. Bobby Stengelwitz of Select Recovery volunteered to help disassemble the hoop to make it at least possible for Miranda to get it back home. It's safe to go now. Mm -hmm. They can get it to where they need to go. Thank you so much for your help for me and my children. Appreciate no problem. it. Any way you look at it, it's been a lot of jumping through hoops over a basketball hoop. Dave Llewellyn, 7 Action News.